Hello everyone, and welcome to the 13th annual Daniel Pearl World Music Days concert, presented by the Music Student Service League of the Music Teachers Association of California, West Los Angeles. We are thrilled to present this extraordinary group of student musicians in celebration of the power of music to promote tolerance and unity. Before we begin, I will read a special message from Dr. Judea Pearl, Daniel's father. Dear friends in Santa Monica and elsewhere, we are deeply grateful to MTAC, the teachers and the musicians who are joining us again on this 18th celebration of the Daniel Pearl World Music Days and for turning this annual event into a cultural landmark dedicated to shared values and shared aspirations. The music that will soon emanate from your stage will not be a music of an ordinary concert but a reminder that music has a secret purpose, to unite humanity around our common goals. We can see Danny looking down on your stage, listening to your music and saying to himself, if my short journey to this planet can bring hopes and inspirations to my fellow musicians and to so many listeners, then perhaps I was not mistaken when I packed my laptop and violin and started roaming the dusty roads of the Middle East and North Africa in search of friendship. Perhaps I was not mistaken when, despite all the violence and suffering I saw around me, I still wanted to believe that man is not a predator to other men, but a brother, a kindred spirit. And perhaps I was right in believing, until the final moments of my life, that music will triumph over hate and humanity will prevail despite the darkness. After all, man is not a predator to other men, but a brother, a kindred spirit. Our deep appreciation goes to the entire MTAC community for continuing this wonderful tradition of playing Harmony for Humanity. United, we will make a difference. Judea and Ruth Pearl.
proof if they knew just how dearly I would love to quonk. But it's true, I'm a bird that seems to lack a neck. I'm just different. I'm just different from the rest. And who can blame them wanting me to find another nest? But different isn't naughty. Different isn't bad. So why should being different make me sad? I'm just different. They're like peas from the same pod. No wonder they make fun of me. Life's harder when you're odd. But different isn't scary. Different is no threat. And though I'm still their brother, they forget. I didn't choose to look this way. I didn't want to be unique. I don't like these grubby feathers and I hate my stubby beak. There's a runt in every litter, one black sheep in every flock. But when you know it's you somehow, your ego takes a knock. I'm just different, but I have a sense of pride. My looks may well be funny, but I hurt the same inside. Different isn't spiteful, different isn't wrong. So why is it so hard to get along? I only want to get along. Could be swell, different.
Far, far 
Looking back on the journey that we carry in our heart From the shadow of the mountain to the waters that would part We are blessed and we are holy, we are children Thank you everyone for attending this virtual concert. We wish we could have celebrated this beautiful event in person, but we are still grateful that we could share this moment with you. The Daniel Pearl concert is always something I look forward to each year as it brings together the community to work towards peace and unity. This year was even more incredible as the concert's online platform allowed for people outside of Southern California to join us in celebrating the message of Daniel Pearl. Although we could not be together in person, we hope you still feel a strong sense of connection to everyone involved in the concert and to the impactful power of music. To me, the Daniel Pearl concert represents the strength of our community through shared music. No matter how bleak the world may seem right now, this concert proves that we can persevere together. For the past 13 years, the Music Student Service League of West Los Angeles has orchestrated the annual Daniel Pearl Concert to uplift those in our neighborhood. We are grateful to have the opportunity this year to share this wonderful music with an even wider audience. Daniel Pearl believed in a world where peace, love, and unity prevailed over all else. Each and every performer today embodied that very legacy that Pearl left behind. And a final thank you to all those who made this concert possible, even in the most difficult of times. Although a virtual concert will never be as impactful or powerful as one in person, these musicians' dedication to their art truly inspires me. A special acknowledgement is in order for Dr. Judea Pearl, for his opening words to this concert, and for his continued devotion to the Daniel Pearl Foundation. 
I am so appreciative of everyone's cooperation in putting on this concert for all of you, and I hope that it was just as much of a delight to attend this performance as it was to organize it.